previous session we have implemented api gateway in this session we shall implement circuit breaker so when client makes a call and api gateway unable to find any url from service registry because the retail bank my service is down that point of time circuit breaker will be activated now let's see how api gateway behaves without circuit breaker for that we shut down the retail bank manager applications and if you can see this i am hitting the direct url and now i am trying to access the api gateway so here i am getting a white level error page so without circuit breaker api gateway will send a white level error page if the target application in our case retail bank major service is down obviously we don't want to send this uh, white label to the end user and we would like to send a customized response that can be achieved by circuit breaker so for that we need to create a fallback controller and in this controller we shall declare a get mapping or endpoint that will be activated in case api gateway is unable to connect the target applications so let's create let's give the name as fallback and quickly create the get mapping i can keep the retail bank fallback in this case let me return a simple string but uh, you can return anything uh, based on uh, your requirement or whatever you want to display to your end user so here i am sending http status and internal server error because we are facing an error and i can send in the body say something that we are facing some issue please contact with support or something like that you can send any customized message that you want to send to your front user front end user using this approach so this is our fallback method now we need to make some configurations so that api gateway should know in case target application is down which fallback method it needs to call so let's quickly do this we need to add and dependency circuit breaker resilience 4j and in application.yml we need to add filters its name should be circuit breaker and here i need to give some arguments first argument will be the name and i shall give a name say retail bank fallback or retail bank circuit breaker whatever it is then we need to give the fallback url which is nothing but the end point of our fallback uh, method so i should tell you should in case the target application is down you should forward this request to fallback retail bank fallback so api gateway if target application is down this circuit breaker filter will be enabled and api gateway will forward the request to fallback retail bank fallback and a customized response will be sent to the end user so it's built successfully let me start it our application is started and you can see we are getting a customized error message we are facing some problem please contact your support now let's refresh retail bank api gateway is up now and now if we hit this uh, api gateway again okay local application is up api gateway takes some time to reflect so sometimes we need to 
clean this browser because browser can pick up this one yes now let's see try it again yes and it's working perfectly so that way we can implement circuit breaker now we again stop the retail bank applications and if you go to eureka you can see it is down now if i go to api gateway and hit see instead of white page we are getting we are facing a problem please contact help this is exactly the message that i have declared in my fallback endpoint so this is this way api gateway circuit breaker should be implemented using spring cloud api gateway so thanks thanks for your time and we'll catch you in the next session please like share and subscribe thank you